one reaction with Levy. Okay, NFC right now, I think we can all agree on this. It's San Francisco and anyone else. So your Detroit, Philly, and Dallas's. Who are you afraid of outside of San Francisco and those other teams? Because it feels like I don't know if these these four teams are going to meet in the divisional round. There's some issues with all three of these teams. There are. There are. Defensively, offensively, there are. So who is the team that can upset them? Who is that team? I think it's the Rams. Since Matthew Stafford and Kyron Williams have come back, they are 3-1 and one over the past four games. They have scored 30-plus on both the top two defenses, according to DVOA, the metric that factors in strength of schedule. So that's Cleveland and Baltimore. They probably should have won that Baltimore game, too, if Sean McVay had some clock management skills. So let's let's start there. They have balance offensively. Kyron Williams running the football. He's been unbelievable. And then throwing it, Stafford to cue a cup. They have that balance. Then defensively, like Dallas, like Philly, like Detroit, they have their issues. But they got Aaron Donald. They got experience. They have a clever defensive coordinator. So I think if you're looking at this and comparing all these wild card teams and who can really give Detroit the game in the 3-6 matchup or give Philly the game in the 2-7, it's the Rams. I think if they can continue to stay healthy, this is a playoff team to me. And I was scared we were going to get a Geno Smith. We were going to get a Derek Carr in that wild card round as that 7 seed. If Sean McVay with Matthew Stafford can develop into a wild card team, that would be a lot of fun for the NFL because on any given Sunday, those two, you don't want to be playing. I don't care who the team is, whether it's Detroit or, or, or San Francisco or, or whatever team. I, I just think this team with, Met, with McVay, Stafford, run game is always tough to beat. 